Hey there, stranger. How's it going? Did you just get done with your presentation rehearsal? Huh? Oh, uh, I just stopped by the front desk on my way up here and saw your name on the reservation paper for the study room. Man, I remembered you saying something about getting together with a group to go over everything. So I figured they might still be up there. I'll go check. And here you are. So here I am. Ta da! <laughs> what can I say? I know you too well. So, everyone's still getting together in the commons for the game night tonight, right? Or did we actually manage to snag the conference room with the projector? Oh, hell yeah! That's gonna make it even better! So, do we already have the first round set up? Is that a bracket? Oh, nice! I won't lie, I absolutely love it when you make them and print them off. Makes it look infinitely cooler than whenever we just draw it on our notebooks. Makes it easier to read too. Remember like that one night where we couldn't even read what it said so we had to remake the entire bracket because we thought it said Ezekiel in three different places? We didn't even have an Ezekiel playing that night. I know! She's our friend and I love her. But her handwriting just looks like some... Egyptian hieroglyphics or some shit, you know, you can't even read it. Maybe I studied it hard enough. I learned how to time travel or access a different dimension or some shit. Honestly. Exactly! And you always add the little decorative borders around the name box things, which are just for cherry on top. Oh, wait, let me see the bracket. I want to see who I'm going to beat. No, damn it. First round and I'm up against. <sighs> yeah, yeah, I know he's new to the group, but have you seen him? It's like all of the gods just fucking looked down on him and said, <clears throat> Child of the prophecy, you shall be blessed with impressive video game skills. You will have better aim than any bot of new or old, and your melee skills will be the death of any hope in your enemy's eyes. No, I'm not exaggerating. Feels like a fight of a death every time I go up against him. Have you ever gone 1v1 with him? Wait, what? Why did no one tell me he's on the eSports team? I didn't even know our school had an eSports team. Ugh. Well, now I know. Let's head back to the dorm so I can prepare snacks and booze to cry into after my untimely obliteration. <sighs> yeah, I'm sure you'll cry at my funeral. I'll leave you my textbooks, my student loan, and my sleep deprivation. Oh, and my flannels. Yes, even the red one. Actually, as my dying wish, yeah? I want you to wear it at the funeral and tell everyone how I used to lend it to you whenever you wanted a late night cuddle session, make out session. Oh, shut up, I wasn't finished. I also want you to tell them how good I was and... Oh, wait, still not finished. Then I want you to cry, like that loud soap opera cry. And throw yourself over my coffin and beg me to come back to life because no one can satisfy you like I can. Yes, all of it. If you don't do every single part of that, then you can't have the flannels. Or the sleep deprivation. Or the pineapple rum I'm bringing, which will be better with my tears by then. Yeah, pineapple. Someone said they were bringing orange juice and... When I saw us at the store, I thought that it would be a good match. But I also grabbed some fireball, just in case it's not as good as I'm hoping. But anyway, we can't start drinking until we get back to the dorms. So, uh, let's get to heading back. It'll probably take a while for everyone to get there anyway, so... Um, I'm gonna see if we should grab some food on the way back. 
Up to you this time. My choice last time was... Underwhelming at best. Borderline food poisoning at worst. Ah, a classic and solid choice. You always know exactly what I'm craving, don't you? But I guess that makes sense, since... Eh? What was that? Did someone just... Oh, great, it's locked. Why did someone lock us in here? How did someone even get a key for the door? If you're the one using it, don't you have the key? I mean, that makes sense to have him turn in the key if he was already headed down to the front desk. But it seems like someone must have taken it from him. Wait, so that's him? Over there? The one that kind of looks... punchable? And those people he's with. That's the rest of your study group. All of them are over by the couches. So do they still have the... Oh, yeah. He's holding the keys. So it was definitely him that locked us in here. How fucking nice of him. dickheads. So, now that we know the how, any ideas as to why they locked us in here? Wait, 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 wait. Hold on. So, they think that this whole time, the reason that I've been hanging around you is because... <laughs> because I'm bullying you? Like some fucking grade school punk? You thought I was going to insult you or beat you up or something? They locked me in here with you while actually wanting me to do something like that? Oh, those motherfuckers. They want someone to actually hurt you. They're waiting to see you get physically injured or humiliated. Who gives them the fucking right? What reason could they possibly have to pull some shit like this? I was fucking... So they just have it out for you because you're willing to work hard to get grades and opportunities that you want? That's such bullshit. Why the fuck do they care that you have good grades? Just because you're doing better than them and getting more opportunities because you work hard to get them? They should be trying harder so they can keep up with you. It's not like you luck into your grades. You know, you actually have to study and work for it. Just like the rest of them do. So it's their own fault that you're better than them. I know they don't care. It's just... <sighs> Makes me mad. You know? Because they think you're just a genius girl who... Never has to try for anything. I don't even know how hard you have to work for everything. School doesn't come easy for you. It never has, but your determination keeps pushing you to go through with it. The only reason you're doing so well is that you put in the effort. Yeah, of course I can tell. The sheer amount of time and work you put into your assignments is borderline amazing. You ever spend hours on end sitting at my lap and making me proofread your papers over your shoulder? I had to hold textbooks open for you to read while you take notes on assignments you did in classes. Hell, you did so many study exercises that I literally have to bribe you to step away from your desk when you're getting stressed. You put so much of yourself into your work that it kind of scares me sometimes, you know? I get worried that you're overdoing it and that you're going to make yourself sick from stress. Honestly, 
sometimes I'll just head you up just to make sure you're not trying to pull another all-nighter on your assignments. Well, it works, doesn't it? Some affections and sweet nothings always relax you. You keep telling me that you get the best sleep when I'm using you as a pillow while you play with my hair. Oh, hush up. I only do it when you really need it. Like during finals week last semester. I had to pin you to the bed before I actually put your pencil down. I mean, really. You almost had me pouting before you finally gave me a kiss. Well, we're both suckers for a good makeout sesh, so can you blame me? I mean, <laughs> hell, that's how we ended up as, uh, well, um, in the current agreement that we're in, I guess. Is that a good way to put it? <laughs> but, um, while we're on the subject of you, me, and, uh, our relationship, what the hell are we gonna do to disprove of this stupidity? Like, don't get me wrong, I love spending time with you no matter when and where, but we have a game tournament to get to. Also, I have like a eight page research paper due at midnight, but the game night comes first. Hey, <laughs> no need to get so irritated with me. I brought my laptop with me so I'll be able to work on it after I get absolutely wrecked in the first round. And you'll be there too. Which is perfect for me because I'm supposed to write in historical present tense, and that always gives me a headache. Look, you can say it's easy all you want, just like I can say that you're lying all I want. It's hard and it sucks, and it's somehow it's still gonna be easier than trying to win against that video game fucking prodigy. But at least you'll let me have a comfy blanket and play with my hair while I work on it? Right? Pretty please. Oh! I uh, didn't actually expect you to say yes. I mean, I'm sure as hell not gonna turn down an offer that good. Your hands are absolutely magical. <clears throat> um, but that's not what we need to focus on right now. Right now, we need to figure out how we're going to get revenge on those fucking dickheads. Huh? Oh, yeah. And how we're going to get out of here. But mostly for revenge. I mean, they can't just get away with this. Really? The fact that they think I'd actually hurt you? But seriously, I want to get back at them. I want to show them that, A, I'm not actually a complete fucking arsehole who goes around and harasses people like some grade school bully, and B, that you are better than them. Because you are. By a lot. <laughs> I just, I, I don't get why they thought that I, of all people, would want to try and hurt you. Do I seem like that much of an ass? Is that what people think when they see us together? And I'm just hanging around you so I can make you miserable? That's the opposite of what I want. I'm your friend. I want to build you up and make you smile. You make me feel like I'm worth the world. And I want to do the same for you. I want to make you happy. Well... I'm glad to hear that, since you make me happy too. But you know what would make us both happy right now? Some nice, sweet revenge. <laughs> yeah, there it is. I know that devilish twinkle in your eyes. You're game for giving them their just desserts, aren't you? <laughs> now that's what I like to hear. So, what are you thinking? Any ideas popping into that beautiful brain of yours? Nothing. 
That's fine, because I think I may have an idea already. Now, stick with me on this, because it's going to seem a bit wild. But, um, they obviously think I'm bullying you, right? So it's safe to assume that they think I intimidate you, and you're some sort of pushover. Therefore, they think we hate each other. So, why don't we prove them wrong on all accounts? What do you mean, how? I think that's pretty obvious. Then again, your brain is probably tired from all the work you've been doing today. Lucky for you, this plan is simple and very sweet. So it didn't require too much effort on either end. You ready? You need to take advantage of the situation and kiss me absolutely senseless. Oh, don't look at me like that. You know I'm right. Think about it. You push me up against a wall, put a hand on me to keep me there, as you get really close to me and get me all flustered, like how I know you like. Then, you kiss me while all of them watch. Let them see me get all worked up over you while we make out. I want to see how they react to the big, scary troublemaker being all soft of a cute, nerdy star student. The next time they see you in the class or library somewhere, I'm going to think about how good you look when you take charge. I want them to look at you and know that you, in every way, can beat them. Of course I am! I mean, I'm pretty sure, but at least ought to give them something to talk about. I mean, yeah, I'll enjoy every second of this too, and that may have played a part in how I chose this type of revenge. Don't try to act like you wouldn't enjoy it either! But think about it. I'd certainly think twice before trying to make a fool of you again. Or if not, at least I'll know that we're friends and won't try to have a specific kind of stupidity again. <laughs> Um, you can just do it however you want. It just depends on how you want to do this. <laughs> you don't waste any time, do you? Not that I mind, of course. I like it when you grab my face like this. It gives me the perfect opportunity to look at you. At your face. Your eyes. Your lips. I see you're enjoying the view just as much as I am. Though, you're doing more than veering at this point. It feels nice when you touch my lips. It tickles, but in a nice way. It just makes me wanna... Oh, why are you moving away? I felt so nice. And I thought you wanted... Oh, you're really going to take my advice, huh? Backing me up against the table like this so you got me trapped? It's an even better view of the audience, though. You think they can see how much I'm blushing from all the way over there? Of course I'm blushing. I got you looking at me like that. You know, all sly and mischievous. Every single time you look at me like that, it always means you know you've got something up your sleeve. You're just letting the anticipation build so I get flustered. Of course I am! You know how embarrassed I get around you. You make me all... soft and sweet. You just make me feel like being sweet, okay? Whenever I'm around you, or you kiss or compliment me, I just want to be sweet. I want to be all affectionate and adoring with you. I don't know, uh, what do you want to do with me? You know I'm fine with almost anything. Why 
what do I want? I... I want everything you want. Anything you want. I want to do for you. I just want to give you everything you desire. Everything you crave. I want to be what you want. Then do it. Do you hear me right now? Do I sound like someone who would say no to you? If you want to kiss me, then kiss me. I'm yours to have. I mean every word. In any way you want, you can have me. <laughs> I guess you could say that just like revenge, I'm yours for the taking. Uh, sorry, too cheesy? <laughs> yeah, it felt kind of weird saying it. I can't tell if it sounded more sleazy or more awkward. Either way, um, you should probably just kiss me to shut me up. And to shut them up, too. Uh, sorry, still corny. Maybe you should just go ahead and... <clears throat> That's not what I was thinking when I said, kiss me. I was kind of hoping your mouth would be on mine, not your hand. <laughs> Thank you. That's much better. But, um, really, are we gonna do this? I mean, you want to, right? Okay, um... Just wanted to make sure. So then, um... How do you want me? <laughs> oh my god, you're so... That was... Oh, shit, that was good. Can we do that again? Kiss me again? Please? Damn. I'll never get over how good it feels to kiss you. I always feel, like, a bit dizzy and weak afterwards. But it's the good kind of dizzy that makes me feel all giggly and stuff. You make it feel so amazing. You make everything feel amazing. I love how you make me feel. I love... <laughs> it's nothing. Just forget it. But really, it's nothing! Forget it. You're not going to let me move until I tell you, huh? Even if I ask nicely? No? <sighs> well, it was worth a shot. <sighs> okay, just, just give me a minute to think about how I want to say this. <sighs> so... There's... There's something I've been meaning to tell you for a while now. We've been friends for a few years now, and I really enjoy our time together. I realized that I want you to be something more. And after this, I can't go back to what we were. I can't just be your friend with benefits anymore. Every single word I've ever said is true. It's been true for a good while now, and I can't make it stop. 
fuck it. You know, I tried to stop myself from falling for you, so I didn't mess it up. But every time I thought I had my heart under control, you'd ask if I could come by to hang out, and I'd get weak in the knees. You know, I, I couldn't say no to you. I could never turn you down. Hell, anything you say right now, I'll follow to the letter. You say you want to go out, I'll take you on a date right now. You would say you want to stay friends, I'd be perfectly happy with that. Or... If you never want to see me again, I can do that. I'll never talk to you or message you ever again, and you can block my number or whatever you want to do. I can't say that it won't hurt, but for you, I'll do anything. You... you actually want to... You... you want me? <clears throat> Wait, do, do you mean it? I mean, I'm happy to hear that. Happy that I can possibly begin to describe, but if you'd seen it now and then change your mind after giving me hope like this, it'll break my damn heart. So, please, if you don't mean this, then, then don't say that you want me. Are you sure? Because I can't... And does that mean we're together? As, you know, more? <laughs> Holy shit. I can't even tell you how happy that makes me. You are so amazing and I just, I absolutely adore you. Um, I know it's kind of weird to ask at this point, but can I kiss you again? I think that you've got me hooked on you. <laughs> You know, you've got me wrapped around your finger, and that's my favorite place to be. Actually, um, speaking of places I like being, this study room doesn't even make the top ten. We should probably find a way out of here so we can get back to the commons. Let's see if that study group of yours is, uh... Oh. Did, uh, did you see them leave? Yeah, me neither. Well, shit. How are we going to get out of here now? I mean, I suppose we can stay here for a bit longer. If we're going to do that again. We'll just wait until someone walks by and gets their attention. But until then, let's enjoy some alone time with each other. Yeah? Hey guys and gals. <laughs> um, Zan here. Oh my god. Um, thank you for listening to this audio. It really means a lot. Yada 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 yada. All the normal stuff they say. And wow, this was a long, yeah, long one. Um, sorry if I sounded kind of like, I don't know, like if I my mood sort of like changed in the middle of recording. Like you know, it's my voice sounded a bit different. Um, I took like two breaks during this because I got distracted. When I was trying to like emulate how I was shining before and it didn't really come out right, but I was like, Nyeh! and uh, and yeah, I sort of just got annoyed. <laughs> so, um, so yeah, yeah. Um, anyway, how are you guys doing? Um, I'm doing okay, I guess. Um, Work was like really, really fucking busy. Like, oh my god, it was busy. 
in a good way though. I mean, I guess it was in a good way. I don't really know. Like, oh, it was busy. Yeah, but like, I don't fucking know. Um, yeah, work was fine. Uh, I cut my phone open <laughs> with with a fucking printer, so that's fun. Yeah, I mean, it, it's not really like painful. It was a bit painful, but like, it's just more annoying than anything. Cause like, you know, you use your fingers a lot and all of that. So if it, I mean, like, it, it's like right. Like, you know, where you normally use it. As well. you, you know what I mean. It, it's it's in a bad spot, that's all I'm saying. It's, like, kind of deep as well. <laughs> like, my finger was bleeding for, like, a solid... I don't know, like, few minutes. Like, ten minutes, at least. Without stopping. <laughs> so, yeah. But, um... Anyway... Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, so... Hope you guys like that, I guess. Uh, how are you guys doing? You guys having a good day? All of that stuff? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, like I just said, I, I don't really know what I'm talking about anymore. Anyway, um, yeah, I've been wanting to do this script for like a while, actually. Like a good while. Um, I knew that it was like super fucking long, so I was like, oh, I'll do it one day, one day. And then I just never really got around to it. And I was, today I was like, oh, you know, fuck it, let, let's do it, let's do it. Yeah, yeah, let's do it. Woo, we can have a way. And then, um, here we are, I guess. Yeah. So, took a while, but, uh, yeah. And all, it did, it did take a while. I think I've been recording for, what, like an hour straight now? Something like that? Usually it takes me, like, I don't know, an hour, uh, half an hour? Something like that? If it's a short one-ish, then with other ones, then it's, like, a little bit different, but... Generally about half an hour, 20 minutes. <clears throat> Including this part most of the time. So, uh... So, yeah. I don't even know what I'm gonna title this, honestly. Like, what the fuck do I title this? I don't know. Like, uh... Locked in a room with your... Uh, friends with benefit? Locked in a room with your friend with benefits? Like, I... I don't know. I don't know. Um... Some shit like that, probably, I don't know. I'll make something up. Um, but yeah. Holy shit, I don't know what to say. Mommy, sorry, mommy, sorry. Um, I've almost finished Breaking Bad. A, A, which I'm really happy about. We're really close to finishing it, yeah. Um, like... Really close. I've got one season left. Um, and then I'm done. And then I don't know what to do after, because I'm like... No, because pretty much, like, whenever I'm done with this, I'm just like, oh, you know, fuck, I'll just go. I don't know what to do after I finish watching this show. Like, what I, I, I can go watch another show. Yeah, like, I guess, but it's not the same. You know? It's not the same. I don't know, I, I guess it's what happens like when you finish any show, like when I finish watching like some really good anime that I was deep into, you know, after you finish it, you're like, oh shit, what the fuck do I watch now? And then, you know, you kind of just like, uh, I'm gonna just mope around for it, and then, uh, and then you move on. Yeah. Uh, yeah. 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 So, um, yeah, yeah. <laughs> anyway, um, trying to think of a question of the day or some shit like that. Um, question of the day is, I don't know actually. Like shit, I don't know. Shit, what do, what 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 do I say? What what do we say? Hey, 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 hey. Um, we could talk about something. I don't know what to talk about. Um, Among Us. You guys like Among Us? You know the hit game? Hit game Among Us? I don't know. Uh, question of the day. What did I ask yesterday? I think I asked yesterday if it 
you guys have watched a Batman film or something? Or I watched that recently and I remembered, oh, uh, I did that a while ago as well. Shit. Like I did, I did the same question twice pretty much. And I'm like, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Um, but it, it's fine. Don't worry, it's fine. That's fine. Um, yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm just trying to think of like, what the fuck to say, man. You know. What did I just do? Oh no, my game just fucking broke. No. Um. <laughs> sorry. Anyway, um, what the fuck do we do for question of the day? Um, could do some shit like, I don't even know. Do I want this on this? Ooh, is that a guy? That is a guy. Um, which one looks better? I think this one looks better. Yeah, let's do this one. Um, oh, that one looks better for a thumbnail. Oh, fuck it, whatever. I don't care. Um, what was I saying? Shit, I forgot. Um, oh yeah, question of the day. Um, let's see. Uh... If you got, oh no, that's too like, that's too shit, isn't it? Yay, it is shit. Um, I don't fucking know what to talk about. How am I supposed to know what to talk about? Um, what is? Your favorite something, something that I don't know. I don't know. Uh, what is your guys's favorite animal? I'm really running out of ideas. I've really asked this like five times. I don't really care. Yeah, what's your Guy's his favorite animal. Um, I don't know. I don't know, man. It's probably like a turtle or something because they're just dumb. I don't fucking know. <laughs> How am I supposed to know? Um, yeah, fuck it. Uh, one of my friends is going to start working. At the same place I'm working. So that's cool, I guess. Yeah. Um nice. Yeah. Nice to have one of my friends from outside fucking there. It's nice. Nice to, you know, see people, I guess. Um Yeah. Uh, the fuck else do I say? I don't know. Among Us? Among Us. Could do time. So fucking doing this one. Um, yeah, so that's nice. Also, uh, there's a company party soon, like, for work. And that's pretty cool, I guess, you know. Company party. Yay. I don't know. Um, I don't really want to go to it, yeah. But like, my my coworkers and my manager are making me go against my own will. <laughs> um, because I don't go out and I don't leave my house. I made no pain. <laughs> so fair enough to him, I guess. You know, I don't blame him. I really don't. I really don't. It is kind of annoying because I would rather spend my Friday night doing something else, but you know, oh well. 
so what? You know? Um, yeah. Yeah. So, um... Oh, fuck. I found a user sky account. Oh, I can't. Shit. Uh, I'm gonna fucking lose my mind. Dude, I'm trying to find a fucking film out of this. I can't fucking find anything. I might want to scream. I don't know if it's the one I was using before. I don't fucking know. Um. Yeah, you know what? Fuck it. I'm. I'm just gonna win this because, like, I don't know what else to say. I've taken up enough of your guys' time. So, uh. Yeah, I'll. See you guys tomorrow, I guess. All of that stuff. And, um. Yeah, bye bye. I hope you have a nice day. All of that stuff. Yada, yada, yada. I've been talking for 40 minutes. Oh my god, bye bye.